All right, today I'm going to give you guys a detailed look at uh, all these uh, 3.75 inch figures. Uh, we have the white Spartan back there, Spartan Mark 7, right there, and then the UNSC, uh, UNSC Marine uh, with the Commando Rifle, and uh, the Spartan comes with the uh, Pulse uh, Carbine, and then um, the Grunt comes with the Needler, and then we have a Spartan, uh, and then another uh, Marine, and then here are the other two weapons and the bases. So I'm going to open all these up and show you guys all these. Alright, and here are all five of them. And uh, you can see two Spartans, two Marines, and one Grunt. And let's start with the Grunt. Let's get a closer look at the Grunt. So the Grunt looks alright. I'm um, not, not my favorite. Uh, it does come with a Needler, which is kind of cool. Mm, yeah. I mean, he, he looks massive. I don't think he's that big in the in the game. He's never this big in the game, so... Uh, but, uh, oh well. I mean, that's what we got. And I'll show articulation in a bit. Just want to show you guys a closer look at them first. And uh, this is the one that comes in the two-pack. And uh, I, I initially, I thought the, the Marines are going to be all the same. But they're actually not. So this one is a single-pack Marine right here. Uh, the helmet, you could tell it's a little bit different between the two. Let's see if I can give you guys a little more focus. And uh, the vest is different. Uh, let's see. The legs are about the same. Well, only the thigh section are about the same. Uh, everything else is different. Yeah, it looks like it's a totally different figure. So that's nice. And then here we have the white Spartan. Really nice. And all these all these uh, figures can hold weapons with uh, both hands. So that's neat. I think out of all these uh, all of these five, uh, my favorite one would be the blue Spartan right here. And then and then after that the white one. But the blue one looks absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. I guess I just like this. Uh, this armor. It's like the look of this armor much more than the white one. So yeah, it looks cool. And uh, the marine base, uh, the single marine, comes with a green base, a grass base, while all the other one has some sort of a snowy type base. And the grunt doesn't come with anything. Okay, so as for the grunt uh, articulation, head is on ball joint. Uh, whoa, good range of motion actually. Really good range. So yeah, he can look every which way, so that's nice. I like that. And then uh, ball hinge uh, shoulders. And then uh, same with the wrists. Right there. Single joint, and then uh, single joint at the wrist. I mean the elbow. Single joint, single joint wrist. Uh, he's holding the needler quite nicely, so I'm just going to leave him leave him be. And then as far as the waist, there's a little bit of waist. It's on a ball joint, but barely anything. And then uh, ball joint and hips. And then there's a thigh joint, uh, a rotating thigh joint right there. Double joint knees, and then a uh, hinge ankle, so that's kind of neat. Actually, he is, he is quite good. Full range of motion. Or a little grunt like this. He's running away. He's running away right now. Look at that. Eep, eep. So yeah, the grunt is actually really nice. I like it. It's kind of hard to stand, but uh, in a in a running pose, I don't think you can stand at all. And then I guess you could use the base and then just put him on the base. Something that's neat. Okay, so let's take a look at the um, the marine here. So let's get the weapon off. So same thing. I believe all the all the figures are uh, all got the same uh, articulation. And uh, the shoulder pad does have uh, uh, it's glued on, so uh, it limits uh, range of motion a little bit, but not too bad. I mean, it's fine. Well, right there is fine, and uh, he can still rotate his arm fully, so that's good. And then the uh, inch, e. uh, the elbows cannot go uh, almost 90 degrees. 
and then uh, the torso, nothing, almost nothing. I mean, you could rotate left and right, and that's about it. It's the way they cut it. Just like all the Spartans and everything, they all got the poor range of motion as far as the uh, the waist is concerned. I mean, the torso is concerned. Then ball joint again, and then really like these uh, thigh swivel joints. And then yeah, same thing. Same with the. All the other characters and uh, you could bend double knee so that's good so yeah good stuff good stuff so let's go over the other spark uh, the other marine same thing so head movement quite good mm, arms to be expected and everything else is to be expected and uh, let's take a look at the spartan i like the spartan uh, this one is really white though so it's kind of hard to see uh, on camera let's move the camera out of the way so yeah range of motion um, if you watch my uh, warthog video then i've already mentioned that uh, these figures basically has almost exactly the same articulation as the six and a half inch uh, versions of themselves and uh, minus the toes articulation and then no butterfly joints and uh, that's pretty much it I think uh, oh and uh, elbows I believe they're not uh, double jointed unlike the uh, six and a half inch they are all double jointed elbows except for these I mean he looks uh, pretty cool uh, holding this uh, plasma carbine is it plasma carbine no it's Pulse Carbine. I just want to make sure I get it right because all these fanboys are going to start saying that I, I mispronounce or don't know my weapons because I really don't. I mean, this uh, these games been out for quite a long time and uh, I I played it once and that's it. I don't I don't remember the names of all these weapons and stuff like that. I wouldn't even be able to tell you which Spartan is this these Spartans are. What number? What letter and numbers they are. I, I couldn't tell you at all. But they all look good. I mean, this one is based off of the um, Noble Six, so that's neat. I like that. I like that. And uh, uh, this weapon, I, honestly, I have no idea what this weapon is. No, no idea the name this weapon. And uh, but uh, the Spartans are really, really good looking. I really like these. Uh, the the three three point seven five inch figures. They're about ten bucks each, and the two packs are twenty dollars. And uh, I think they're 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 quite good for what they are. Uh, what what you're getting? Uh, yeah, really nice. How good of a range of motion he has. The head uh, head is not that great for the Spartan. The Marines got better head articulation, and the Grunt has better head articulation than the Spartans. See, this guy has. Yes similar issues oh this one has a little bit better head articulation that yeah. you can look up a lot further than uh, this guy here because it's hindered by the piece back here of the helmet yeah but still this is awesome awesome character I like the fact that the the, the shoulder armor it's lower down to almost like bicep armor so it doesn't even pee with the articulation at all Look at that, full range of motion for the arms and ratcheting joints too, so that's awesome. Yeah. Oh, this one has a torso articulation, look at that, it's pretty good range of motion from the torso. Okay, look up in front and back, come in front and back. What about the Spartan here? Uh, no, not so much, this one not so much. Why is this one so much articulation? This one has such so much better as far as range of motion with this guy much better than the other Spartan than this Spartan or the Marines yeah not that much but they all look fantastic I have to say uh, totally worth getting so there you have it all five of these figures uh, oh, let me do a height measurement here um, the grunt it's about four inches if you're counting the tip of that um, that armor and then uh, the Spartan I mean the the Marines are about three 
8.85 inches or so, somewhere around there. And then the Spartans are about 4.25 inches. Yeah. So there you have it. There are all five of these uh, 3.75 inch uh, figures, 118 scale. And uh, I really like them. And uh, if you're on the fence about them, uh, maybe if, try to get a Spartan. Uh, get one of the Spartan uh, and then see if you like it. And if you like it, then get the Marines. And uh, the grunt, the grunt is cool. Um, but uh, as far as the um, um, the two pack, uh, yeah, these are two pack. Two packs are about uh, twenty dollars. Single figures are ten dollars. So I think they're okay uh, with the price. And uh, there you go. These are Jazzwares, um, three point seven five inch figures from Halo Infinite. Thanks for watching.